Well, tonight, police are searching for a shooter who opened fire at an Allen Park bowling alley. Thunderbolt was just minutes away from closing when a shoving match inside turned into a shooting outside. Mar McDonald is live in Allen Park tonight. So, Mara, what do witnesses say happened here? Kimberly, would you believe that what we are hearing started all of this is because somebody decided to try and cut in line at the bowling shoe counter? The surveillance cameras in the parking lot here at Thunderbolt capture what happens next. One of the men involved in the shoving match inside goes to the parking lot. You can see him start to hustle towards the door. He meets up with a group of people and then runs toward the door, firing what looks like about eight shots into the building. The interior doors were closed, but the door to the vestibule was open. Three people were hurt and had to be taken to the hospital. Honestly, it is a little shocking. We've been coming here for quite some time and we've never had an incident of, of sort. Um, you know, like my family's in there right now. It's like a really nice family establishment. The bowling alley has surveillance cameras, metal detectors and security, which broke up the shoving match over somebody cutting in line all about 10 minutes or so before Thunderbolt was going to close. So we've been coming here for a long time. This is the first time I've ever heard anything like this happening. And this is really an incident that could happen anywhere. Back here live, those three people in the hospital we are told are in stable condition. Allen Park PD looking for the shooter at this hour. We're live in Allen Park. I'm Mara McDonald. Back to you.